Tonight, how your iPhone and a few other gadgets can help prevent post-surgery surprises after breast implants. Katherine Shreves joins us with tonight's Beauty Breakthroughs with Kat. Well, hey, Jessica. Well, if you're thinking of going under the knife to get a bigger bust line, you probably have a lot of questions like, what size should you get? How will they look? Well, a Covington doctor has invented some easy ways to find out if implants are right for you. If you've always wondered if bigger would really be better, you highlight the breast, get out your iPhone, I augment, and see for yourself. Just upload a picture. So it works best if you're wearing a bathing suit top or a bra or a tank top. And select your size. And then at the bottom, the implant sizes appear, and you just select one and the breasts get larger. Covington plastic surgeon Dr. Elizabeth Kinsley invented the free Eye Augment Eye app as a fun first step for women considering implants. You could show your friends, your boyfriend, your husband, and say, what do you think? It's just part of a package of pre-augmentation tools Dr. Kinsley says can help you decide if implants are right for you. And once inside the surgeon's office, Dr. Kinsley says the Axis 3D is the latest technology in 3D imaging to give patients the most realistic look at what their breast could look like. So this is her naturally and then her with a moderate size implant and, a, and then a larger implant. Brandy Smith knew she wasn't happy with the size and shape of her breast but wasn't sure if she wanted implants. Originally I didn't know if it was if I should get a lift or if I should go with breast implants. After trying out the Axis 3D and this take-home kit, and just put it right through here. Brandy knew implants were the answer. It just allowed me to be sure of what I was doing. The kit comes with a special insert bra, four different size implants, and an instructional DVD. And so when I brought this home, um, I was able to actually put it on and, you know, even show people that are uh, that really know who I am and maybe exactly what I wanted and to see what they thought about what size. Dr. Kinsley says because breast augmentation is major surgery, women need to be informed before going under the knife. We want them to be a part of the decision-making process. As for Brandy, all of this meant no post-surgery surprises. It makes you feel better because you got exactly what you thought that you were going to get. And there are two kinds of implants on the market right now, saline and silicone. But Dr. Kinsley says that the new gummy bear silicone implants that everyone's talking about, they're called that because they have the consistency of a gummy bear, could be available within the next few months pending final FDA approval. And to find out more about the products and gadgets in tonight's story, just go to abc26.com slash beauty breakthroughs. All right. Thanks, Catherine.